So seven elements are designed by David Torres. Okay, let's get space. As you can tell, I kind of printed a picture of space. Space right here. That's it. This is what I'm talking off of. This one right here. It's like size of space. I printed it out just to make this. But space is basically like if you had a thing in the middle, you know, like like in this picture. Space deals with illusion, depth, of flat surfaces. Basically, if you stick a shape in the middle of a picture, that's shape, you know, like, or no, space. That's space because, you know, you're getting, you have a lot of space. If you just have one apple, you just have one apple like this in the middle, then you got all the space surrounding it, surrounding it. So that's basically how you do it. Line, however, this is a clear, a clear, uh, a clear image right there, but line is like if it's pointing different lines in my head, like if I take a picture and it's with a brick brick pattern and all the lines are coming to me, the attention's coming to me, basically. Now shape. Shape is uh shape is basically using different shapes to perform a big image in a picture, and that's that's basically shape. Most of shapes areas are enclosed space that are two-dimensional shapes are flat. They can only have height. Basically shape is different shapes using them using the thing. Size and scale. Size and scale. Size okay, size when I talk about size, it's used to convey importance, attract attention, and carry contrast. Okay, like this one right here. I don't know if you can see size. That's that's size right there. Like you have a smaller one, you have a bigger one, then you have a bigger one, then you have the bigger one, then they have the biggest one. It stacks and stacks up and stacks up, you know, until until that happens. So it's basically using a ladder, basically, for size. Color. This one. Color. You're basically using color to generate emotion. Like this one, it's an emotion of like cracking. That's why the brown's in the middle, so it's cracking. That's what they're trying to get to you, that, you know, it's cracking. And, uh, yeah, it's basically, I, I was going to put more pictures in there, but, you know, it, I mean, that's the one that stood out the most, and it explains it very well, if I can say. Next one is texture. My second favorite. Texture is basically, you look at the picture. You feel it, you, you imagine like you feel it. Well, let me look at this other page. I also have this other page to talk to, over to. But texture is the type, the surface quality of an object. Actual texture, you can feel it. Apply texture, no actual texture. So this is like no actual texture, but it kind of gives you an idea of what kind of feeling you're getting through those ropes and stuff like that. So, you know, at, uh, it kind of, Kind of just, you know, this is like you're looking at a real one, but you're actually looking at a picture. Value. Is this one I'm talking about is value. Value. Is value describes the brightness of or a dark darkness area of color. A gradient is a series of values from light to darkest tint. White added to color to make it lighter. Shade black added to color will make it darker. So basically, this is a lot lighter and less darker. If that makes sense, it's like a less lighter. It's like that is that is that is the darkest. That that's adding that's taking away its value. And I'm sorry the picture's in the way, but like I said, I'm reading it off here. Reading off of here. It's basically seven elements of design. It didn't print very good like I wanted to, but I printed this just off the case. Um, talks about, you know, it talks about that. And then I also have this other one which didn't print very well, but it shows you, like, elements of design. It shows you size, texture, it explains, but it's blurry. Like, I can't read that. And so, like, that color or color, shape, size. It shows you, like, shift space, si uh, value. Darken, whiten, shape, many shapes, size, texture, the feel, color, and the other one, yeah, value. And, uh, but yeah, you know, thank you for watching, thank you for your time, hopefully you enjoyed it, 
Sorry for the background noise. Got a lot of nephews and stuff like that all over here. But yeah, thank you.